viewers of the tube, thanks for tuning into the channel this Friday evening slash Saturday morning where I am in the Lego dungeon and it is looking clean my friends. This Lego dungeon is looking so clean I could almost drop test a leopard green grocer. Quick little update video showing you the cleanliness. Oh yeah, what I've been working on and mainly the CMFs. And when I'm talking about the CMFs, shout out to Jacob Tmog217. Much appreciated, buddy. Your bag feeling skills are immaculate. That sounded a little wrong. It sounded a little dirty. But you got to give credit where credit is due. I was short Huey, Dewey, Louie, and Princess Jasmine. Tmog217 went to the local watering hole and grabbed these for me. Much appreciated, buddy. You are solid. You are solid. So now I have complete series Simpsons 1 and 2, Disney 1 and 2, the Looney Tunes, honestly, like the whole series 1 through 21, whatever we're at right now, CMFs, yeah, some of them are cool, but nothing really speaking to me, nothing really says, hey, Mark, blow your cash on us. Yeah, some are cool. I think this is like series 16 or whatever it is. Again, there's a couple knights and Vikings throughout all those different series, Hot Dog Man, chicken soup guy shark soup guy they're pretty cool I like collecting the different Batmans that's about it I'm not a huge CMF guy and if I am they gotta be a little something special the new Marvel didn't really float my boat considering we got all the good minifigures in the Daily Bugle in my opinion so I wasn't too goo goo gaga, whatever you want to call it, over the Marvel blind bag CMFs. I felt like I got my fill with the Daily Bugle. And they're just not as cool as these guys. Again, my general opinion. So where did everything go? This big old shelf. Now that I got all this space, I can just walk straight to my parts wall. Nothing's gonna get in the way. There's no walking around anything. There's no stumbling, staggering, tripping, or falling over anything. Back here we got a bunch of empty bins. The top one has all my promos. We got some extra fire trucks, train track. We got cars, tow trucks planes, helicopters, and in the very bottom, the four bins down at the bottom, is all my Lego instructions. Just rammed in those bins, but that's okay. They are slightly waterproof, so even if it flooded down here a couple inches, those bins will at least keep the instructions somewhat dry. I got a couple shelves, although it's really dark, a couple shelves, that are cleared out. I gotta tidy them up a little bit and then I'll start transferring over some Lego sets from the shelves behind my build desk to the shelves we just seen so I can put other Lego sets here and kind of keep changing out, changing up the background if you will. Change up the background so that the live streams always got different Lego sets behind me. Some more action if you will a quick little video keeping the ball rolling we got a Lego City update in the works if you don't want to miss that don't forget to like subscribe and ring that bell and that's about it I hope to see you guys all around throughout the live streams this weekend I just want to say take care stay safe definitely have fun Hope to see you all in the next one.